हेलो डी स्टूडेंट्स एंड वेलकम टू दिस ऑनलाइन क्लास वीडियो दिस इज द फोर्थ एंड द लास्ट पार्ट ऑफ द चैप्टर थर्ड हाउ मेनी स्क्वायर ऑफ क्लास फाइव सब्जेक्ट मैथमेटिक्स एट फर्स्ट लेट सेवन ओवर व्यू टू डेज क्लास सो इन टूडेज ओवर व्यू वी हैव फोर टॉपिक्स द फर्स्ट इज पजल्स विथ फाइव स्क्वायर द सेकेंड इज गेम टाइम द थर्ड इज मेक यूर ओन टाइल विथ पेंटोमिनो एंड हेक्सोमिनो एंड द लास्ट इज प्रैक्टिस टाइम सो कम टू द फर्स्ट टॉपिक which is puzzle with five squares so let's reading first measure the side of a small square on the squared paper on page number 45 that was actually 1 cm the length and make as many shapes as possible using five such squares three are drawn for you okay so in the next page we can see that three pictures are drawn here and these all are made with 1 2 3 4 and 5 okay with five uh, squares so first i want to clear a word that is pentomino that what is pentomino so you can see a picture we have here and uh, it has five squares and its all edges means sides are connected to each other okay and they all have same area means they are same so this type of polygon is known as pentomino if you want to define so the words you can write that uh, pentomino is a polygon and in the sorry a uh, pentomino is a polygon in the plane made of five equal sized squares uh, connected edge to edge clear now come to the question in the next page so here we have to draw some other uh, pictures but before drawing that we have some questions so first read that all so the first is uh, how many different shapes can you draw we will draw that then we will write that how many uh, shapes we draw then the second is find the uh, longest perimeter from that shapes and how much is that we will write then shortest perimeter we have to find from that shapes and what is the perimeter we will write that and area of the shapes we will also find so for this i have a picture Uh, of uh, pentominoes so you can see that a b c d e f means 12 pictures 12 shapes are made here with pentomino so now you have to answer the first question that how many uh, shapes we have drawn so you can write we have uh, i think 12 let me count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 yes we have 12 shapes and the second question was find the uh, longest perimeter so you can see that the longest perimeter is means uh, a b c e f g all are looking like same perimeter how much is that now come to c to find the perimeter 1 2 3 4 5 5 the length is 5 cm and breadth is 1 okay so 5 plus 5 10 1 plus 11 plus 1 12 so 12 cm okay actually a b c this all have same perimeter okay but d is not 12 cm because its uh, perimeter is looking like small comparing to other shapes so let's count it that how much is that uh let me zoom it first so now count uh, it is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so total 10 cm because one side let the length of the one side is 1 cm so all side we count that we found 10 cm so this is the uh, smallest perimeter and the name of the shape is shape d now uh, and also there was one question we have to find the area so it's very easy the area the all figure all shapes will have the uh, equal area how can you say because this is pentomino and pentominoes have same type of squares and the area of one square is 1 square cm so area of 5 squares will be 5 square cm okay and this all shapes have the same area now come to the next page now uh, did you get all the 12 shapes using 5 squares yes we got that and Here is the notice that uh, all twelve shapes are arranged here to make a rectangle. This is a ten by six rectangle as there are ten rows and six columns. So here you can see that it has ten 
रोस एंड हाउ मेनी कॉलम्स ये सिक्स कॉलम्स एंड यू विल बी सरप्राइज टू नो दैट देयर आर मोर देन टू थाउजेंड वेज इन विच दिस शेप्स मेक अ टेन बाई सिक्स रेक्टेंगल्स ओके सो दिस टाइप ऑफ टेन बाई सिक्स रेक्टेंगल आई हैव एंड आई वॉन्ट टू शो यू हियर यू कैन सी दैट बाई यूजिंग अ टेन बाई सिक्स रेक्टेंगल सम शेप्स आर मेड ओके मीन्स सम पेंटोमिनोज आर यूज टू फील दिस टेन बाई सिक्स रेक्टेंगल यू कैन डू इट नाउ इन द नेक्स्ट पेज ड्रॉ ऑल ट्वेल्व शेप्स ऑन अ शीट ऑफ कार्डबोर्ड एंड कट दैम यू कैन कट दैट विच आई शोन टू यू नाउ इन द नेक्स्ट ट्राई एन अदर पजल ओके सो यू हैव टू मेक अ फाइव बाई ट्वेल्व रेक्टेंगल विथ दिस ट्वेल्व शेप्स देयर आर मोर देन वन थाउजेंड वेज टू डू इट If you can find, so try it. So five by twelve, we have a rectangle, and we have to use pentominoes to fill this five by twelve rectangle. So here is the picture. You can see with different uh, patterns, uh, like one, two, three, four, five. Okay, this shape you can see. It is used to complete this five by twelve rectangle. So this type of other uh, patterns you can see here. Which are used to fill this five by twelve rectangle. Now, uh, in the next question, we have uh, next page is game time. This is our next topic. So here is a chess board. You can see it and play this game with your partner with one set of twelve shapes. Okay, you all know how to play chess, but uh, here we will not play chess. This game is different. Actually, we have to use pentominoes. Okay, so how you will play that? For example, there are two friends A and B. Okay, so in this all uh, in these shapes, what uh, A will put some pentomino shapes. Okay, and B will also after uh, after A B will also put some pentominoes. And at last, at the end, who will put the last pentomino? So he will. Win this game. He will be the winner. In this way, you can play this game. Now, in the next page, uh, Ziri went to a shop and was surprised to see the different designs and tiles on the floor. Aren't these beautiful? Yes, you can see these are beautiful patterns. Can you find the tile which is repeated to make each of these floor patterns? Circle a tile in each pattern. Yes, we can find that pattern. tile pattern which is used so here you can see this one okay this one is a tile pattern which is used repeatedly and also this is now in the next page after looking at the patterns ziri wanted to make her own yellow tile you to make a tile this way so here are some steps to make a tile yellow tile pattern by ziri and here you have to know the dimension of this uh, square shape so it is square of side 3 cm okay remember this length because you have to solve some questions in the next page so the length of one side of this square is 3 cm remember that okay now in the next page so ziri finally ziri has made a beautiful tile pattern here you can see in yellow color and uh, now we have to find its area okay and also we have to find that how many uh, number of tiles is used so this two questions are here so first is how many tiles has she used so first answer this question now let's count the number of tiles so here you can see that the squares are here 1 2 3 4 5 6 these are complete Uh, square so we can take as six now here one two three and four five six we have six half uh, tiles okay so number of tiles will number of uh, complete tile will be three because we have three halves and also here on the left side one two three and four more four means six plus four ten. So total we have ten uh, half tiles. So number of tiles will be five. And complete squares there were there were 
6 6 plus 1 11 okay now look at the corners here okay these are how much of the whole squares yes you're right this is 1 fourth okay this type of question we have solved in the previous video and here we have 1 fourth means 1 2 3 4 4 uh, tiles with 1 fourth so it makes 1 so 11 plus 1 12 so we found that total 12 tiles are used okay to complete this pattern now what is the area of the floor pattern that Ziri has made here so it's very easy to find area of a floor we have to first find area of single tile as given in a previous page the one side of tile is 3 cm so the area will be 3 into 3 that is 9 square cm so in the first question we have calculated there are total 12 tiles so if you do 12 into 9 then we get the area of entire floor that is 12 lines are 108 square centimeter is it simple or not yes it is very simple now in, uh, in the next we have practice time so Ziri tried to make some other tiles she started with a square of 2 cm side and made shapes like this so here are some shapes A, B, C, D so look at this carefully and find out so some questions are here which of these shapes will tile a floor without any gaps discuss what is the area of these shapes so first you have to watch it properly that which tile is uh, will be used on the floor with uh, without any gaps so if you will take a so here you can see the card is here okay if you will put another tile here so that will also have a card so that this portion will be gap and also in b here are gaps so a and b are not used okay now c and d yes you can see that c and d are uh, it may be used to complete the floors because there will be no gaps and here is a picture of it i want to show you and where is the picture just to wait uh, sorry don't have i don't have but uh, if you will use c and d so you will get that now next is uh, make designs in your copy by tiling those shapes and now you can create your own tile out of a square can you do the same with a triangle try doing it you can do it now uh, there's a question that i wanted to ask you but i just forgot that uh, we have cleared the first topic was yes puzzles with five squares and we used a word that was pentomino so i want to ask you that uh, this there are many mobile games okay that you play which is based on pentomino so write the name of that game in the comment section that you play okay dear students now in this way this lesson is completed and at last I want to say if you have any doubt uh, regarding the area and perimeter you can check its previous video the definitions the way of uh, uh, explanation is uh, in the previous videos of area related to area and perimeter you can check that and if you have any doubt so you can comment I will definitely answer that all now it's time to stop the class and see you all in the next video with new lesson till then bye bye dear students